the Bible stand for? Basic instruction for leaving earth. See, <laughs> this didn't exist. What happens? Mm. Mm -hmm. We wouldn't know. We wouldn't know. But praise the Lord. He provided this whole earth. Yes. He put, just like he's doing to me now. <laughs> he put in the John, John the Revelator, like in Revelation, he's giving prophecies, and they're coming true. That's right. That's right. Because they're one of them. And Boyd Glass told me, well, all of it, this hasn't been um, fully announced in truth. Let me tell you. Look on the news. Look in the revelation. Wow. But if you stay in a Christian life, you might go through thorns, but you'll you'll make it. Hopefully. Amen. Look again. <laughs> My whole life I've been taught. I've been going through thorns. But the way to sin is death. Death. Do we truly know what death is? No. Until we actually go through the experience. Sin. To forgive us of our sin. And to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. I won't have these leg pains anymore. I'll have a new body. That's right. Amen. I'll be happy when everybody that has a disease. It can be cured when you get there. Mm -hmm. Thank the Lord. Mm -hmm. But if you aren't saved, my opinion would go to John. Start. Look at all the verses I just read. If we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to forgive us our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. This Bible, this, it's just, it's not a just, it's big. Yeah. This is like one big prayer. Look at the end, the end of Isaiah. You know what it says? You go, and you know what you see? Amen. That's right. Mm -hmm. And I hope you can realize it. Like one big prayer that he provided you. Mm -hmm. 